Well, hello friends. Welcome to Maria's Miscellany, where in this video I'm going to uh, work in my little journal. And um, I only have about really like 10 minutes tops to um, do something here. I got to get ready to go to work. It's Monday morning. and uh, But check it out. Um, I went ahead and put some lace on the edge of this uh, little journal. And I just used Fabri-Tac. Uh, to attach this lace sticking a little bit to the back but that's fine you know I really love fabric tack because it does do a good job at attaching some you know your fabrics your laces and things to your paper and uh, because I, I really love to sew my laces in but since this book is already made I thought it, you know it's just a lot easier to glue it in now I could still have sewn this on you know I could just put this under my sewing machine and do that but, um, you know, again, it's just a lot easier to just glue in the lace. So I added a couple of pieces of lace. I probably will add more because I really like that. I think I might add some to the cover. But anyway, I'm getting sidetracked already. And I, like I said, I don't have a lot of time. So let me go ahead. And um, what I wanted to do today um, before, you know, it gets away from me is, and maybe I'll do it on this thin page because what I have is, this uh <laughs> packaging from our spinach we bought some spinach um and i just loved that the packaging had popeye on it <laughs> and just a little trivia fact um my one of my husband's nicknames from years ago was popeye so there's a whole story behind that but anyway just let me just say it that much right now so yeah so i loved the spinach packaging and of course i also loved what i made which was creamed spinach with um you know keto friendly uh so that was fun anyway so i just wanted to i'm, it's, I'm not gonna do a lot of uh, special designing or anything i'm just gonna lay it down here so i think i like kind of the background of the music there and I like this it has recipes too, so that's kind of neat. And I'm just gonna kind of let let th let this hang down like a flip in a way. So, so I think I'm gonna go put Popeye up here. It doesn't quite fit, but you know what? I'm gonna let it flip out again. I just uh, I kind of broke off the top of it there, and I think. I want super food in there, but not necessarily all together. Although I like that little curving thing. So maybe I will just attach it like that. Okay. Yep. And again, I'm going to use Fabri-Tac for this because I think it's probably going to be the best glue for gluing this since it's like a plastic. And I think Fabri-Tac will glue that down well. So again, I'm going to let that flap out. And let's just put this down here. So I hope everybody had a good weekend. Um, I have uh, some, uh, I want to say exciting things possibly happening <laughs> in regards to this channel and maybe my business. So um, stay tuned for that. And actually, if you want to chat with me about that, privately please go ahead and email me because um i'm in this stage right now where i'm still kind of thinking things through and you know if you want in on that i have asked of just a couple i mean literally two people um that have you know known me here on youtube for a long time now for their opinion so i'm waiting to hear back from them <laughs> But I would be happy to talk to you about it if you are in any way interested in what I'm talking about. And if you have no idea what I'm talking about or you don't care, no problem. <laughs> uh, you know, it's just one of those things that's been going in my mind. One of my harebrained ideas, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> so, we'll see. Uh... But yeah, I, I could not throw this packaging away. I mean, can you see why? <laughs> okay, it's so cute. It's like, why do they make packaging this cute? And then, you know, then I have to keep all this stuff and then it gets piled up and doesn't get used. But you know what? I am making a resolution 
I mean, it's not an official, like, New Year's resolution type thing, but, ooh, maybe this sticking out the top might be nice. Let's see. Nah, I don't think I want him sticking up quite that much. I think I will just let him flap about to the middle, and then it could fold up. So, but, yeah. Um, yes, a lot going on in my little brain here about uh, this channel and... Uh, even my Etsy shop and, and a lot of other things. I want to kind of get a little bit more focused and um, organized. <laughs> That's possible with me. <laughs> okay, so there we go. And then check this out. Look at this. This is their little trademark. Or what do they call it? I don't know. Yeah, trademark. It says it right there. Let's see. Okay, usually this doesn't work unless I do it like this. Let's see. See if it'll focus this time. Yeah, there it is. Look at that. See, is that cute? Do you see them there? You got Popeye with olive oil and, um, oh, Wimpy, I think it is, and Brutus. And is the baby there? Is Sweepy in there? I don't see. Oh, yeah, Sweepy is down there. Isn't that cute? Yeah, come on. I couldn't throw that away. <laughs> All right. And where should I think I'll tuck them right under here and then you can flap it up to look. Sorry, here. I'm off. Okay, yes. That's what I'm going to do. And. Oh, also, I wanted to tell you, I did make a sale this weekend. Yay. I sold one of my journals from my Etsy shop, and which I had them in storage. So I had to tell my dear husband, my Popeye, that, um, that, you know, we had to go to the storage. He was not too happy. But what I told him is, let me just take the bin, you know, the whole uh, container, tote, whatever you want to call it with all my journals in it and then that way you know if and when hopefully i sell another journal we don't have to come back here it'll just be in you know in the apartment and so he agreed with that and so that's what we did maybe i'll fold that up right at this line here okay and then if i want to write some more about it i have this little space here still put a little bit more glue and um so so we did that and i'm so excited because I got some of my journals that I've been wanting to add to back. Like, uh, let me show you real quick. One that I've been missing a lot was my glue book because I'm not quite done with it. So, so here it is, my little spread. Again, I haven't written anything down because I don't have a lot of time yet, but I have this space to do that. And maybe I'll also add, because this happened this weekend, and if you watch my videos on Thrifty Thursday, you will see what I paid. Actually, I didn't pay that. It was half off. But um, So maybe I'll just stick this in here since it was the, the a weekend thing. I'll just ha kind of have it tucked under here. Um, you know what? I, I'll do that. I'll just, I wish I would made this a pocket. I'll just have it tucked under here like that for now. Maybe I'll glue it down later or... Because, see, these are nice because they're actually little tags, you know, literally. So, I've been gluing them down, see? Um, but, you know, I can actually use them as tags, too, as, you know, anyway. All right, so now I'm rambling, and I said this would be a quick video. But, hey, it's been under 10 minutes, so I'm really happy about that. And, um, oh, but since it is still under 10 minutes, let me show you it. Again, do you remember this? Oh no, I forgot. Look, this this piece. I can't. I can't let that go unglued. Um, although Popeye approved superfood. Let's see. I'll put it here. And I don't need a lot of journaling room. Um, but I don't want them hiding under there. Popeye. Okay, here we go. Superfood spinach, and then it says Popeye approved superfood. Let me just cut the circle a little bit better here. So yeah, so before I let you go, I'm gonna show you my favorite glue book so far that I have made. And I am already working in another one that um, is just like basically a magazine that I'm gluing into. But the one I'm gonna show you now is one that I made during one of Dear Julie Julie's challenges, which are awesome. I, I think some of the favorite journals that I've made have been following her challenges. So that is, um, it's just something really cool. And this is one of them. It was during her junk 
only junk challenge or something like that. One of her just junk challenges. Hmm. It got a little dark there, but that's okay. He's in there. <laughs> All right. So let me just tuck this here. Put it away. I'm just going to do this right now. And let me show you what I'm talking about. And I know I have some new subscribers. So if you're not, if you have not seen this before and would like to see a little flip through of it, let me know and I'll, I'll do, um, I'll do one, um, before gluing in it again. Um, and which I will do very soon, probably this week. So, but isn't it beautiful? I made it with, it, it's a um, cereal box, actually two cereal boxes is the um, cover. And it's covered with some old jeans. And the, these little doily pieces are from a, an old like tablecloth or something that I thrifted. And then all these little bits are from like, this is all jewelry. And these are just things I added later that were gifted to me, these beautiful little pins. And I will show you this. The tabs are from the cereal box, you know, the side of the cereal box. So, yeah, let me know if you want to see um, a new flip through of this one. And I'll do that before I start gluing it in, a, in it again. All right. Well, thank you so much for watching. I got to get running. Now I went over 10 minutes, but okay. <laughs> Thanks again for watching. Have a blessed day. Bye.